Hello, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to do a review over this exciting Bible that Logan is holding for us. So this is the Promise, it's Promise Book Bible. So it's kind of like confusing. The Promise, well, it's the Promise Bible Book, but KJV Bible. Um, this was sent to me from Barbara, Barbara Publishing. I greatly, greatly appreciate you sending me this. It was a complete surprise. It just showed up and I'm like, wow look how beautiful this is so as you can tell just from the cover alone it is adorable but so this is just the, the um dust cover sleeve so look at this i would love to share the back of it because more than likely i'll end up skipping over something or not explaining something because it is so 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 beautiful all right now remember look at this retail price you guys you know you can always find it on sale, but look at the price, okay? Don't forget the price. For what we get inside of this amazing, cute Bible, will we love it. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and remove the dust cover. Look at that pattern. Do you see those flowers? This was an amazing, an amazing combination um, on the actual design of this Bible. It is a hardcover. It is a hardcover, but I am super, super excited to have it in my collection. I have to say, this is one of the first hardcovers um, that doesn't really feel like, like a book so much. That's why I'm not really a fan of the hardcovers, because they just really look like a book to me. But this really looks like a devotional Bible. It really, really does. Okay, so we have it sewn. So there's two white um, sewn down between the pattern hardcover and I think it's I don't even know how to describe the texture but there is texture these beautiful beautiful flowers and then we get cloth over here so there's two different textures but this cloth will wrap around to the back look at that beautiful coral color now on the spine we do have the white really really nice elegant color we have the Bible Promise Book, KJV, their little logo, King James, and then Barbara Publishing. We get one satin little ribbon. And for a Bible this size, one is seems to be good. I mean, everyone can always use two. We all know that. But one seems to be good. Now, this is my sewn. We do get white head and tail bands. And we just got white pages. But they are cut at a beautiful angle here so it's not just like you know squ squared they are beautifully cut so the craftsmanship is beautiful again for the price there's a lot of detail work a lot of attention that went into this Bible love the pink look at that baby pink so 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 beautiful all right so here is the copyright this Logan hey come on come on excuse me excuse me excuse me sorry about that <laughs> all right so it was um, printed designed everything only last year so it is a brand new Bible it is printed in China so we have the table of contents for both the old and new we have a tropical index of all your daily promises. So if you just want to find one specific promise, you can go right to the index and it'll take you to, you know, one over happiness or joy. You can find it back there with a dictionary and a concordance. But I'll take you all through that. So at the beginning, we have the introduction to what this Bible has. So we have 365 daily promises. And it gives you a little bit about it. Let me bring you in closer. We have 400 points, so promise points. And over 150 Bible promises. So you'll see a couple of pages. And it breaks it up through the topics. The references, where we can find it at. And even the page we can find them on. So we do have a couple of pages of those. And then we have, I think this is the, what is, 
just the introduction to the King James. So the, the dedicatory. Here is the title page. And the book introduction. So the book introduction is really short, sweet, um, straight to the point. The introduction to Genesis, the author, the occasion, and then the promises in Genesis. So just quickly read that. And all 66 books of the Bible will have that. Now getting into it, we can see it is a single column format with verse by verse. Super, super excited about that. So we can see the chapter numbers is in bold along with the header. And you can tell each verse is over here at the left hand side. So if you did want to do some underlining, you can. Um, you could do some, you know, the, the spacing between the letters, are sentences, words, all of that. Everything is beautifully laid out. Now, over here towards the right or the left, sorry, towards the left, we have a daily promise. We do have the subject that it's over in the verse that it will be covering. And just looking at this, it takes you back to Matthew and it really had, even down through the promise, it has something that you can apply. So questions, not only one, but two questions you can ask yourself. That is beautiful, especially in a Bible. So if you are a new Christian, a seasoned Christian, it does not matter. Coming into this Bible, you can get re-excited, re, um, give you a different way of looking at things, especially when the promise of God asks you, simple questions something to get your wheels turning so we always come into to the bible and we're like well how can i do this how can i use this bible how can i apply it to my everyday life oh the word is just so old i don't even know especially the old testament i don't know how i can use it for myself a bible like this can really 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 help get you started on that path so down below we have bible promises they are in bold They have subjects to go over. And then we have promise points over here on the right. So we have a daily promise, Bible promises, and then a promise point. Again, it will cover a subject and it will cover the verse. And as you can tell, the promise will also refer to other verses throughout the Bible. So I love that. More Bible promises down below. So this is super, super exciting, especially if you are doing a Bible study, um, not even uh, like with other people. So a lot of people think Bible study. So that means it's a group of people. It's, it's you and your friend, you and your family, you and your church. It doesn't necessarily have to be like that. You can do a Bible study on your own. You can have this Bible. Um, maybe you don't want to mark in this Bible, so take out your notebook. Maybe take out a wide margin or another journaling Bible that you're using. And write out, answer the questions from God's promises. I mean, use multiple Bibles to really, really help you. Um, Bible Pub Barbara Publishing also has an amazing Bible that will go really really good for what I am suggesting you to do I'm getting it off my shelf with this Bible so this Bible along with this Bible writing in the margins God's promise to you answering out the questions would be amazing so if you have not seen this Bible I will leave it linked in the description box below I do have a review over it more so like every single page you will find there's either a promise point there's bible promises down below or you will have a daily promise so super 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 excited to actually get into this bible see what little nuggets i can pull i'm really excited to actually go through and answer questions it's like it's like a workbook it's something that really gets me thinking 
super excited to do it and of course I will be sharing what I do both on Instagram and in my Facebook group but so let me show you this is the psalm so this will be like Psalms 19 well no this will be Psalms 19 I love showing the psalms I don't know what it is but I just love sharing the psalms And the font looks to be about an eight. And the bleed through, it is a little bit stronger on actual, on the um, phone than it is in real life. I always say that. I'm like, I've been reading it for the past couple of hours and I haven't, haven't struggled at all. Okay, so this is even one more exciting thing. This is also red letter. So do you know how I was telling you, remember the price, remember the price range. Look at this red letter. That is beautiful. It's a beautiful, dark, blood, extremely well printed out red. So we get the red and black. So I was super excited when I seen the red letter. I'm like, yay, that is beautiful. It's not really light or pink like the Bible. It is beautiful. So, 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 so beautiful. All right, so we get back here towards the back. Now the index is not like an extensive or the concordance isn't really in depth, but you do get a, trop a topical index, which is over all the prom God's promises through the Bible. And the concordance, it's, it's real, you know, it's real little, but it is a dictionary and concordance. So it is helpful. It is extreme, it's two columns extremely like you can read it so illegible was what I was going to say and then that is it that will end it it shows this beautiful pink pink cover oh I love it so I am so 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 excited to um, share this Bible with you I will of course show you how I'm using it I would do more updates to um, give you but yeah so Make sure you check out this Bible. If you do have this Bible, let me know below what you really enjoy about this Bible. And also make sure to check out the description box. This Bible will be linked there. All right. So remember, be a creative tool in our Father's art box today. I'll talk to you all later. Bye.